never seen that, never heard of it. That's baloney. I talked to some pool people. Never seen it, and it makes no sense. The pool skating scene in Fresno is just so big because it's so hot here. There's just vacant, abandoned homes everywhere with empty swimming pools sitting there stagnant waiting for us to find them and clean them out and people travel from all over the place to come skate these swimming pools. The median price of a home here was $355,000 and right now we're in March of 2009 the median price has gone down to one fifty-five. dollars The day that I put my house on the market was the day that buyers stopped coming out in droves. Failure has to happen for capitalism to be a success. Good old Greenspan and Bush trying to hide the fact that there was a war in Iraq, keep your people happy, keep the rates low, allow people to tap their, their equity out of their homes, keep the economy going. Meanwhile, we're spending $10 billion a month on a war that really didn't need to be there. More jobs, more employees, a company with low interest rates, low cost housing, everybody began to buy homes. Betting on that next month they'd be worth more, next year they'd be worth more, and all they'd have to do is buy them, hold them, and flip them, and cash in on a profit. Is it acceptable? Is it okay? Um, do, are we at fault? Um, I, I think we're all at fault, to be honest with you. Then, you know, you had all these little brainiacs on Wall Street that figured out how to do all these mortgage-backed securities and derivatives and, you know, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, and, and just blew the thing completely out of, uh, when they actually made a market for bad securities. I did not sell one stinking loan like that. I think we're actually bouncing off of the bottom. When I'm out driving around and I see an Escalade or a Hummer, I say, let's follow it. And my wife would say, well, why? And I said, well, what's gonna be our next foreclosure? <laughs> the people that were that stupid to take the loans were so stupid that they didn't screw themselves like that, they would have screwed themselves another way. Dude, it was so nasty. We got, I almost puked. Like, Jamie's all, oh, there's a dead gopher in here. Look at all these maggots. They'd arrest me if I was hanging out with strippers and drinking beers at a skate park. <laughs> But hey, I got the whole economic crisis figured out. <laughs>